Hi, I'm standing in front of a Julie mango tree. And Julie mango is probably the most favored mango in Jamaica. And one thing to notice, besides this beautiful fruit, is the size of this tree. This tree is about 12 years old. Julie has a natural dwarfing or slow growth habit. So it's very easy to keep these trees small. And as I said, this tree is 12 years old. It's only a little bit taller than I am. When you compare this to a tree, let's say a Tommy Atkins or some of the other trees that get huge at the same age. So this is one of the advantages of this tree. It's a small tree and it also produces an excellent fruit. Very unusual, the shape. You can see that it's sort of flat on the sides and has this little beak here. Uh, doesn't develop a whole lot of color. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and pick this one. It does develop sort of an orange color. This one actually feels soft enough or, or ripe enough that I'm going to go ahead and try to uh, open it. I'm going to cut along the seed as I try to do with most of them. It's very juicy. Very, very juicy. Beautiful color on the inside. This is a gorgeous looking fruit. And uh, the aroma is very nice. It has a unique flavor. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and try a piece. Mmm, this is really good. Very, very good. Um, excellent quality mango. Uh, some of the drawbacks of Julie, it, it doesn't tend to produce a lot of fruit. Uh, it also is susceptible to anthracnose uh, somewhat. In the dooryard situation, probably not as much. But this is like eating dessert. This is excellent. This is really good mango.